in about 20 minutes, those two big doors are gonna open, this truck's gonna drive out, we're gonna head out to our brand new test track. So wish us luck, we'll see how it goes. Things are looking good. Coolant's on, okay. pump's on, it's on up. Why am I so nervous? I'm, uh, yeah. Are you feeling that too? Yeah. <laughs> you can hear the coolant uh, sloshing through. Yeah. Once it circulates into this, into the controller, it kind of stops sloshing. It sounds way worse than it is, but that coolant pump is loud. Motor controller temperatures and batteries. And right now everything's looking great. So back. Oh, what was that? Did something die? Yep. Let me shut high voltage off. So we'll do the start stop button. So the other the one. This yeah, one? yeah. I we'll can do press that. that now. Yeah. And then we can do that again. Start it. Yeah. Okay, we're in neutral. Okay. You got you're all ready? Yeah, everything like on I, I it reported those faults, but there's faults I've seen before. The error code on the PDU is I think related to um, a connector not being in. So I wonder if it's just bumpy and if something's not in all the way. Which is obviously not great, but it is a little rough, but yeah. Yeah, but the track's way smoother, so. Fuck! It did it again. Well, it did break down on the very first run, uh, but technicians are back here. We're gonna have a look at it. It's probably a loose plug. More than likely, we're thinking um, the last thing we were doing was playing around with the um, charging port, and it could just be an error code on the charging port. So we're just gonna have a look, see if there's any loose wires or loose plugs. We are still waiting on the professional wiring harness, but we get that after we fully confirm that this wiring is all correct. Okay, so it was an easy fix. We found out what happened, figured I'd give you a rundown on it. We thought it was a loose pin and the computer was losing because it was a loose pin. It was actually the computer unplugged from the power wire because we were working on it in the day and we we're like, hey, want to get this truck out? It's near the end of the day. Let's go do some driving. They hurry to put things back together. They forgot to plug in one of the computer power wires again. They had it disconnected when they were working on it. And now there's a battery in line where if you lose your main power, you can still operate and drive the truck for a little bit. It can still monitor everything. It's actually a pretty useful safety feature of like, hey, we lost the batteries. We lost the main power wire. We can still keep going. Alert happens. But because it was plugged in, we were able to drive it for 10 minutes up on the jacks. We got it down, we drove it for two, three minutes in the yard, and then it died, and then we did it, had a little bit of power, moved again, died. Thought it was a pin, nope, easy fix. We just had to plug it back in, worked really good the next day. <laughs>